let's talk about rheumatoid arthritis, a musculoskeletal disorder that you're gonna wanna know for the NCLEX exam. Rheumatoid arthritis is a chronic autoimmune condition that results from your immune system attacking the synovium of the body. This is considered an inflammatory type of arthritis. It's very important not to confuse rheumatoid arthritis with osteoarthritis. This condition can affect all joints. However, it's typically found mostly in wrists, fingers, elbows, the neck, and sometimes the shoulders. Now, even though this is an inflammatory condition, sometimes this can manifest systemically. So we might see um, manifestations in the cardiovascular system, in, within the lungs. Sometimes we'll see patients present with anemia or even a fever. Clinical manifestations of rheumatoid arthritis include inflammation, Stiffness at the joint that lasts greater than 30 minutes to an hour is a good indicator. We might also see swelling or redness and even warmth around the joints. So nursing considerations, nursing interventions, you wanna understand that there is no cure for this condition. There is also no etiology for how or why it occurs. So the best thing we wanna do is disease management. We obviously wanna decrease any kind of swelling and we want to control and manage the pain. Interventions for rheumatoid arthritis include medications. Uh, we can use steroids, NSAIDs. One of the popular medications for this condition is methotrexate. Patients will also have, um, they can also have surgery, right? They can uh, have arthrodesis or a synovectomy, which is the removal of the synovium and joint replacement. Other interventions can result in range of motion exercise and just overall resting the joints. If you found this helpful, please do me a favor, make sure you're following this page, save this video for later, and take a future nurse.